Welcome back again, my hot diggity dogs. How you doing? Um, I, uh, again, just as a quick repeat here. Screw- oh no. Oh, it just crashed on me again. So this has been a very rough video to get going in here. First of all, I, I uh, got my recording messed up. Then, the second recording, my game crashed three times. Which I felt like shouldn't have happened. And now, I'm trying to get going in here, and we're going to see if we can make it happen. So, uh, what we're going to do is we want to get this and this. We want to get a little bit of magic over here, and a little bit of magic over there, and uh, we're ready to go. And what we're going to do is we actually want to get a high-level stone circle tower. It's a little bit weird, I'll admit it. But it's going to work out pretty well. Uh, there, he's really strong, you know, if you get him up to thir third tier is the first time where he like actually gets quote-unquote strong. But fourth tier is when he really starts to take off that arc mage. That thing's nice. So we're going to splooge on these guys. We're actually going to go for an early next wave here. And uh, there we go. We finally get the third tier. Still need on 375, though, for this guy. I mean, if you look at the difference, we got 33 to 56. Okay, that doesn't seem very different, 33 to 56. But now he gets to uh, shoot a lot faster. It's a very slow attack speed right now. So we're just keeping them all, you know, occupado right here. Just, uh, you know, they're getting splooged and damaged, and we can put them to sleep here and everything. Once you put them to sleep, though, that's the that's the time when they really start to die. Swords ready. I'm gonna lightning these web spinner spiders right here, and then whenever you're ready, man, you can go onto the next wave here. For the queen. But I want some bears. That's what I want. Give me some bears. All right, these guys are sneaking through a little bit further than I would have wanted them to. But Katha's here. Katha. Oh, I didn't get him up yet. Oh crap, that's why. I, th I thought I had the Arc Druid Henge already. That's why I was spending money in my barracks. Well, that sucks. <clears throat> All right, now we got this guy, and basically now we've got average attack speed. So that's the difference between these two. Great uh, versus average, or, or very slow versus average. All right, now it's bear time, baby. So I'm talking about, and we're gonna get the lightning. Oh, here we go. So watch out. This is where it gets a little weird. You wanna move your bear guys out just a little bit back. You can sleepify whoever you want, but realistically, you want to pile these guys up. So we're gonna sleepify them, and we're gonna lightning. And we are bear time. We're ready. We got a bear. You can't get through a bear. <laughs> And not just any old regular bear, we're talking about a mythical ruined bear. Right? Sounds like, you know, like we, ru we ruined his life. We didn't. We didn't ruin your life, little buddy. He's a, he, he has runes on him. He's like... Not a real bear. He's like a, he's like a human turned into a bear kind of thing. I think. That's probably the best way to explain it, I hope. So uh, we're going to bloop, freeze those guys real quick. Let them unweb spit me. And hopefully... The bear, oh, the bear gets just web spitted again. All right, that sucks. But it's okay, because we're going to splooge on them real quick, take down all of these guys. There's still a few web spitters, but guess what? We're going to get... Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Two bears. Two bears, baby. And this is wave uh, five already. We only got one more to go. If possible, I'd like to not use my lightning on wave five. But realistically, if you see an opening and you feel like it's going to just help you out, you just do it, you know? But realize that you are doing almost all of your damage with this thing right here. And in fact, what I can do is I can get this up to the ranger barracks. They have a little bit better ranged attack, actually. I'm going to splooge on him again. Ooh, there's a hoplite coming in now. So here we go. Uh, you know what I'm going to do, guys? I am going to lightning him. I'm going to lightning him real quick. we got some harassers, 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 cutthroats. And then a hoplite again. So. Let's do that, and we're ready for the next wave. Uh, now, a bunch of gold again. What am I going to do with it all? I think the uh, best thing for me is actually just to keep everything next to the Archmage. You know? I've only got... I've got this one choke point that's working wonders for me. Why change it? In fact, we didn't make it crazier. And we can get some more barracks peeps up in the action over here. Nobody's getting through now. But, oh, be careful. Oh, be careful. Oh, crap. Screw that up. Screw that up. 
forgot about this little trail right here. Oh yeah, didn't I? Oh boy, did I. And we can move back in action now. So there's one last hoplite, but for this guy, guess what we got? Lightnings. Lightning. Thunder and everything under. Is that a saying? It's not. I don't think it is. Alright, so uh, yeah, that's basically it. Just clean up these last few guys and you win the game. Bears. All you gotta do is get bears. Bears, they win everything. I've learned to like the bears a lot more recently, actually. I used to not mind the bears, but now I just, I just like them. They're just, they're cool. They're fun. They're interesting. They, uh, they regenerate. Very similar to the the golems in the other uh, original Kingdom Rush, where they're like kind of strong and tanky and just overall fun to use. But there we go. That's the heroic challenge. Now we've got to do the iron challenge, which is only archers. And again, the Arc Henge Druid. So, very similar strategy coming from us. We're going to go bump, 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 bump. We use Katha to block here. And uh, what we're going to do is we're going to get the bears as our first, uh, some of our first things that we're going to get. Here I come to save the day! Death will come swiftly to all that oppose the bears. Uh, but again, keep in mind that a lot of my strategy relies on the fact that I have Katha over here. And Katha is uh, a great defender. She's a great staller. If you're just a full damage doer, you might not be able to you know, pull this off quite as efficiently as I'm doing right here. Man, I hurt my wrist a little bit. This kind of sucks. Ugh, I've been playing this game for... It's not even like... Uh, it's like an actual hurt of my wrist. It's not like I've been playing too long kind of thing. So we're going to actually lighten this hoplite real quick. And it's bear time. Here it is, first bear of the day. And I think it's about time to splooge. Some venom on splooge action right there. <clears throat> and if these guys want to get splooge too, I guess I'm down for that. Yeah, we'll splooge on you. Let me look at the damage it does. We're 180 down to... 100. So we do 80 damage per guy. We did 320 health of damage right there. That's like half of a hoplite. Dead. Alright, so there's another hoplite coming in this time. <clears throat> I'm gonna go for the second bear here, though. Alright, looks like I do kill that guy, but I don't know. I might need to lightning this hoplite. Uh... Yeah, I'm gonna just do it. We're gonna get the barracks, guys. We're gonna lightning him. Don't feel like fighting him for like three years. We get our second bear going already, though. And then with the extra money, though, now that I've got that covered, I'm gonna start getting some archer towers. Hopefully, this archer tower can just clean up <coughs> clean up anybody who tries to sneak through. So basically, we have a lot of defenders now for having no barracks units at all. Uh, we have a lot of defenders. Two bears. Reinforcements. We got our hero and four pixie warriors. So, I mean, that's more than enough to defend. But we got a lot of Twilight Harassers coming in right now. So, we see uh, five coming in, but we see an even bigger bundle over here. Three, six, seven of them coming in again. Uh, so, what I want to do is I want to wait for a lightning, but we want to splooge on the. Uh, splooge on some of these guys real quick. So, we're going to put these guys to sleep. We're going to splooge on this wave, and we're going to wait for a light... Oh, there's even more coming out. We're going to splooge on this wave. We're going to splooge on these guys. And we're going to lightning in the back over here. And then I'm just going to buy uh, whatever we can buy. It's going to be a little close. But I think we can handle them with that uh, Sleepify right there. They're going to keep on jumping back into my Arc Druid Henge. And there they go. They do all die. It looked a little spicy there. It looked like we might not kill them. In fact, I think it might have been better for me to lightning the big group of guys right here instead of lightning the guys in the back. Not going to lie to you guys. Slight mishap on my part. For your, for your game, probably want to do that. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed, press that like button for me. I'd appreciate that a bunch, especially if you're having to redo this video. <laughs> I know, it was a pain. And, uh, uh, of course, have a super duper delicious day.